All right, guys, it's time to go serve some papers. I want to take a quick minute and show you some of the tools of the trade, uh, things that we need every day out in the field process serving. Um, we'll start off, of course, you need your pen notepad. Um, it's even better when it's got your logo on there. Uh, so if I come across a new customer, I can always pass this out to them. Body camera, definitely uh, something you need. It just helps prove that individuals were served, that I say were served. And so if I ever get called to court, this definitely comes in handy. Flashlight, I can't tell you a number of times it saved me from dogs, especially out in the uh, rural county and rural country. Uh, at, at night, you don't want to be caught without a flashlight. And then uh, I carry my gun with me as well, um, just for my personal safety. Uh, and this is just something that, um, in case something gets crazy, it help me stay safe. And most importantly is my coffee. Uh, if I don't have my coffee with me, you're not gonna see me on the road. Driving around all day and you're sitting in your car, um, I could have an hour one direction and, and it's important to not get bored. So sitting in my car, listening to podcasts, listening to, um, uh, you know, Crime Junkie is one of my favorites, Joe Rogan. There's a multitude of other podcasts that I really enjoy. Um, so if I'm not doing that, I'm usually on the phone, uh, taking calls from clients, talking to other servers and kind of working them through the fires that arise throughout the day. Showed up to my favorite coffee shop, first stop of the day. I'm gonna run into Java Dudes and get me some coffee. Hope this is the address. I don't see any markings on the door. Recording started. Hello, Benton County Process Server. I just want to take a quick stop out here in the county and uh, not only enjoy the beauty out here, but talk about, um, you know, the miles that we drive as process servers. Um, you know, on a typical year, I'll drive anywhere from 35 up to 50,000 miles in just one year. And uh, keep in mind, that's just in my very local area. I don't, uh, I don't travel as far as a lot of other servers do into other counties. I pretty much stick to two county area. And so uh, it's a lot of wear and tear on your vehicle, uh, which that's an expense that we incur, you know, and we have to maintain our vehicles throughout the entire process. Yeah, so uh, there, there's a lot of times that I'll get an address and we're, uh, my GPS will drop me in the middle of the street. And so then I have to determine, is it a good address? Is it not? And so we may have to get out of the car and kind of look around, um, check house numbers. And, and a lot of times it's a bad address. And with that, we have to, you know, go back to the client and say, hey, you know, uh, do you have another address? If not, then we offer skip tracing services to where we can try to locate an individual where they're living now and uh, actually go and actually get the paper served. So that's uh, another service that we do offer. And uh, again, you know, uh, right now we're just not having any luck and we're trying to find this address. And, uh, you know, you can see there's a lot of addresses around us here and, and all the numbers are not good. So um, we're just not having any luck on this one. Oh, sorry guys, phone call coming in. Yeah, over in Four City, is this? Oh, it's a good one today. Hello, this is Cody. Hello, this is Cody. Good, how are you doing? I need a summons served on an individual that lives in Van Buren. This is a common occurrence. You have to stop and get gas, fill up the car, you know. Uh, my car gets on average about 400, 420 miles a tank. Uh, I probably fill up my tank, you know, two to three times a week. So that just tells you how much I drive in a week. Um, of course, every day is a little different. So some days I'll drive 100 miles and some days I'll drive, you know, two or 300 miles. So it just really depends uh, on the day and uh, the workload for the day. So. 
uh, you know, today we've put in, you know, not that many miles, but we've been kind of all over different places in the county, so. So the real reason I wanted to make this video is just to uh, let my clients know kind of what it looks like in a day in the life of a process server and really showcase uh, all the trials and tribulations we have as we go throughout our day and the different directions we're pulled and tugged in. Um, so we may start our day on a certain route and we have these certain plans and at the drop of a hat that could change. I can get calls to go to you know, this direction or this direction and uh, it, it really can make it challenging and you have to be very uh, proficient in multitasking and uh, be willing to be pretty flexible in your day.